Sarah in CUNA joined us, and her 13-year-old wants to go on a movie date, and her husband is like, I'm going to go, and I'm going to sit in the theater and watch. <laughs> He's a protective papa. Foul. I kind of feel like it's just too young to be going on a solo yeah, date. Yeah, Lauren, Lauren's got a bigger issue with 13 and going mm, on a date. I want to I mean, know. Luckily, the theater is normally pretty pretty safe, right? Yeah. It's a pretty safe date, but still, I'm a little on the fence about this So, one. fair or foul, spying on your kids' dates, like if they go out to dinner, do you go to the restaurant and just hide over the booth? <laughs> 208-468-1027. You can call us or you can text us on the Idaho BMI text line 68719. Let's go to Natalie in Meridian. Is this fair or foul, the spy on your kids' date? This is absolutely foul, and I'm a mom of boys, and this is totally unfair for that little boy. 13-year-old, okay, yeah. he's got a dad staring down yeah, him from true. three rows back in the movie theater. <laughs> Breathing down his neck. Yeah, he's 13, too, and if you come out with a 13-year-old boy, he's not this confident, suave person this dad is thinking about. He's a little kid. So, <laughs> That's I true. Know. I didn't what, think no about that. A, lot, a bunch of reasons. So, w- w- if, as a parent, how would you kid. how would you handle this situation if, if it was flip-flopped? You have a you know 13-year-old daughter that wants to go on a date, and your husband is very concerned and wants to keep an eye out. What do you do? Do you just say, sorry, I mean, this is just the way life works? Yeah, that's, that's what I would tell my kid. Look at this. You, would, you might have a crazy dad sitting two rows behind you. You don't want to go out on a date. A lot of people that's may true. say if you don't want to, yeah, you don't want to date someone with a crazy dad. Like that's <laughs> that's, a, that's a red flag already. Okay, so Natalie, right. you're saying foul. Don't worry about it and just let them go on a date. No, I'm saying I'm saying yeah, they, that it's okay for the kids. No, no, no. Actually, I say that they're too young. First of all, okay, but it's a total breach of trust. So if if they have to, they just need to be honest with their daughter. Yeah. yeah. Honestly, that's a Thanks that's a good call. way to look at it. That's that so is, true. Uh, and that's Natalie in Meridian. So she's she's got thirteen year old boys and she's like, Listen, it's not some like, Hey, what's up? My name's Clay. Yeah, I didn't think about the poor kid and like how intimidating that would be oh, if he I think knew the dad, the dad was wants around. The kid to be intimidated. I think yeah. he wants him to be scared. Well, right? I think it just a lot shows of dads want that. Maybe this just shows that the dad really feels that she's too young. If you can't trust her to go out by herself. Right? And maybe that's the thing. You shouldn't only you you should let your kids go out on dates the moment you feel like you can trust them to go out by themselves. If you're yeah. so worried about them being alone, maybe you shouldn't let them go on dates. Again, every parent can decide. Well, it's not my the thing. choice. Um, Sarah on Radio Therapy, her question was not, "Is my daughter too young to no. date?" Her question was, "Is it fair or foul that my husband goes and spies on the date?" Yeah, can he? That's go? not what we're getting on the text line six eight seven one nine. A lot of people are saying way too young to date. Okay, don't so even let just, her go. Don't even give don't the even opportunity. Don't let her go. They're saying she's 13 years old, far too young to be on a date. Uh, but I like this suggestion. Someone said maybe mom and dad should have a date night and see a different movie at the same theater. Okay. So like they all drive together and then they just separate into different theaters for How the movie. How would you like to be 13 and double dating with your parents? I don't well, think no, any 13 year old. another theater. Gotcha. <laughs> Did you ever go on a double date with your parents in high school, like going uh, out with a date? No, and I you, didn't. I don't know anybody that does that. Mm-mm. I mean, that would be very No, odd. I didn't. But my grandparents uh, actually introduced my cousin to his wife, and he went on a double date, first oh. date with his grandma and grandpa. Oh, gosh. It worked out. They're married. <laughs> a double date with your grandparents? Where are you going? chuck a Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. That's awful. So uh, 68719, Idaho BMI text line, is it fair or foul? To spy on your kids' dates, show up like let's say it's mini golf and you're playing two holes behind, just watching your kids on their date. Is uh, that creepy it, or fine? So Jose's texting in. He says, "If you do it correctly, you don't have to worry about what they do on a date." When my girls wanted to start to date, I made sure they came to meet us first. Okay, when they showed up, I was dressed in a black suit. <laughs> the room was not lit very well, and when they walked in, my son played oh the Godfather gosh. theme song. I was just about to say that's Godfather. That's and a I scene from Godfather. With a rasp- Voice. <laughs> Let me tell you something. Oh if you mess gosh. with my daughter, I will break your fingers. Now, this is 